So there's a build-up of pressure from both air and also blood inside his chest there. Now, he is likely going to tension with us doing this, so I would like to move fairly swiftly. So the next thing that we need to do is what's called a finger thoracostomy, which is an invasive procedure. It's been used by intensive care flight paramedics in Victoria for the last two and a half years, thereabouts, where we make an incision into the side of the patient's chest. So sharp out, guys. Sharp out. And we get through their skin, their fat, their muscle, through the ribs and into the area where their lungs are. And we puncture a hole so that any pressure that's built up inside surrounding the lung can escape out of the patient's chest. We'll just wait till yeah. Matt's There you go. Here. There's your haemothorax. Yep. The research out there shows that paramedics can do a good job, especially here in Victoria. Intubation, the finger thoracostomy and the use of ultrasound were all procedures that were once considered had to be done by medical professionals, i.e. doctors. But nowadays with good education and training, paramedics are adopting these skills and procedures and performing them very well. There's definitely air coming out with each breath there. The bleeding seems to be slowing down as well, which is good. 